We all hate mosquitoes, don't we? Like going out at this time of night? Yes. Especially I living know. here in Florida. I mean, I'm itching right now just talking about it. <laughs> well, should scientists mess with nature to massacre mosquitoes? You can vote now on our 10 News app. Just click on the As Seen on TV section or go to WTSP.com. We're asking you because the government's asking you. Now, time is running out to share your opinion before the EPA decides whether to green light a mosquito experiment in Florida. 10 News reporter Liz Crawford has the story that has all of us a little itchy today. That's very distinctive. Scientists are hoping to move forward with an experiment they hope will decrease the population of mosquitoes that spread Zika, yellow fever, and dengue. It would be interesting to see how far down they can reduce or suppress uh, the Aedes aegypti population. If approved, scientists will release genetically engineered mosquitoes over two years in Monroe County, Florida and Harris County, Texas. Similar experiments have been controversial in the past. And it worked well. It did reduce the populations, and I think it was down to about the 80% level, maybe a little bit more. The problem is, once they stopped, the rebound was almost instantaneous. The same biotech company that is asking the feds to be able to release GMO mosquitoes in Florida and Texas released them in Brazil. Oxitec released 450,000 genetically modified Aedes aegypti each week for just over two years in Brazil. The theory? The modified males would mate with females and pass on a gene to offspring that wouldn't allow them to reproduce. According to a study in Scientific Reports, some of those offspring are surviving. That's creating a hybrid mosquito, a mix of populations from Cuba, Mexico, and Brazil. Now, scientists are asking whether the genetically modified experiment was a success. Nature always finds a way. A hybrid mosquito sounds frightening to me. It's like a it's movie. Frightening. Like, what, what are we talking about here? October okay. 11th, by the way, is the deadline to share your thoughts. We put a public link to the comments section, a submission, I should say, within this story on our 10 News app. So back to our question. Should scientists mess with nature to massacre mosquitoes? And right now, 52% of you say absolutely they should, with another 25% saying not in my backyard, and then 22% depends on the test results. You can continue to vote right there in our 10 News app.